Hey, 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 comic book lovers. I don't even know why I said that. Star Wars lovers. What the hell's wrong with me? Uh, welcome Hi. back to another RSG roster review. And today we're looking at our good friend and supporter of the channel uh, from the RSG Guild, Reality Skeet Gamer Psy, Vormax. And Vormax has uh, asked us to look at his roster and see, see what he's got going on, make some suggestions, things of that nature. And joining me on this journey, of course, is the great beardless one, the brown Gandalf himself, government Wi-Fi stealer, Grande Patron. Grande, you're what up? What this? up? What up? What up? Yeah. Yeah. Let's get let's get right into our boy War Max's roster. Yeah, I've got um, his Star Wars GG. Uh, so he, so, he, so he, he, let's just to kind of give everybody an idea. War Max, um, and this is a real easy way to tell how long a player's been playing. He's got about forty three hundred um, Galactic Wars. I kind of did some quick math. He's been playing a little over twelve months. Mm -hmm. So this kind of gives you an idea of where he's at in the game. He's in a he's in the reality skewed gamer side guild. I want to give a big shout out to the RSG guild. We know and love that guild and very very much. And um, it is um, it's it's also Affinity's guild, and so we're very very happy that he's that he's from there. Um, just kind of looking a little bit. Probably the first place we want to start is uh, is probably start with his arena team. He's running uh, Rex lead. Mm -hmm. He's running Wedge, Biggs, Chirrut, and Bays. Um, he's got he's got them. Uh, he's got everybody. He's got uh, Rex at gear eleven. He's got Wigs at gear eleven, or excuse me, Wedge at gear eleven. Biggs at gear ten. He's got uh, Bays at gear eleven, and he's got Chirrut at gear ten. He's running. Um, he's he's running uh, Bays at, at uh, five star and Chirrut at six star, which is fine um, for those guys. Which is totally fine for that. Right, right, right. Looks like he's got uh, he's got Rex completely maxed out on the gear. Um, looks like he also has a um, couple more pieces he could stick on his um, he could stick on his wedge. Um, mm -hmm. And he's, he's got a he's got a uh, let's look at his bigs here. He's potentially got uh, he's got one more one more piece to get to that gear eleven on um, on bigs, and then on on uh, on bays Malbus. He's got a he's got a few more pieces that he can stick on bays in gear ten, and then uh, and then on Chirrut, um, I think he's kind of doing the same thing. So he probably needs to continue to get those players to gear to to gear level eleven. I, I think that there are maybe a few there maybe a few some mods, strategic pieces mods too. I'm looking at some he of needs mods. Gear, he, yeah, he he needs in he needs in gear eleven. But other than that, I would um, I would say that uh, that that's a really good team. Um, and, and you can kind of tell that by where he's at, he's kind of running in that, uh, he's kind of running it 20 to 50 uh, range, you, you know, all the way up to all the way to 19. Yeah. He's kind of got up there. So it probably, um, that's a really good team. Yeah. It's a solid team. You, you know, if we were going to look at some, if we were going to look at maybe a couple of characters, he might, uh, you know, if we look at his total, um, his total number of characters here, uh, you could tell he used to have Emperor Palpatine on that team, but he took Emperor Palpatine out. And um, Trooper. And sh and so potentially, um, it, you know, I know you can see that he's uh, he's working. You you might see him put a uh, a general Kenobi in that team. I know that. Uh, well, let's see where his Kenobi's at. Uh, his, so his Kenobi, his Kenobi right now is five star and gear eight. Okay. So he's got. I, he probably has a little bit more gear to put on if he wanted to go full triple cleanse um, with a Kenobi. Uh, he could he could probably put him in at gear ten even if he wanted to. And then if he wanted, and then we can also look at his Nihilus, just if he wanted to at some point run that team, um, see where his Nihilus is. He's running, he has a, uh, a five-star Nihilus, also a gear eight. Um, let him, he needs to do a little bit of leveling on that, but he doesn't have to do that for sure. Right. Um, just if we keep looking at, if we, the other kind of things that we, you know, is a very uh, kind of um, mature roster. We probably want to look at his, uh, his scoundrels real, real quick. For the scoundrel event, yep. Um, uh, that was probably one of the places I was going to look at. Um, looks like looks like he's he's running a, a stormtrooper Han Lando gear eleven, Boba Fett gear ten, IG eighty eight, and and uh, and Han Solo is uh, is gear six. That's probably how he's running that mm. um, for that uh, for that event. That that probably works fine if he's able to three star it. He could probably leave that alone. Um, if we were going to look at uh, potentially some other ones, uh, we want to uh, potentially look at his at his mods. And so, if we kind of go through here to SWGOH, 
.gg and look at his mods, and we kind of just. Yeah, let me switch I just wanna, that around here. I had to. I want to show your your screen, but I'll go back to. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was, you know, if we want to look at his um, at his, and just kind of see what we have, um, for mods, uh, and and I'm I'm just gonna click everything that's um, all the different shapes, and let's kind of see where we're at with like a speed secondary. He yeah, has some. He has some. Some really good mods um, that are potentially not on his arena team. He might need to do a little bit of switching around on those. It looks like he has, you know, he has some. He has five dot defense. He has five dot potency. Health open. Um, looks like he's still working on his um, on on some crit damage. Um, he might work a little bit more on some of those on some of that crit crit damage set, and then um, and then potentially go from there. Um, yeah, I'm looking at some of his, but he does have some primary hit. speed. He's got 30 speed on Rex. He's got 30 speed on Wedge. He's got 30 speed on Base. He's got 30 speed on Churret. However, Wedge, I don't see any speed primary on Wedge. So if you're going to run him on the team, I would suggest that he, because he's got a 30 speed on Lando. He's got a 30 speed on. <laughs> <laughs> on Jen, he's got 30 speed on Maul. I mean, he's got a ton of 30 speed. So potentially, so potentially, he might want to do a little bit of remodding and get a speed arrow onto that. Um, at least, you know, you want those that. guys to be as fast as possible because you want them hitting. Yeah. Them. So he might he might need to do a little bit, and potentially we want to if we go back and look at his arena team, and we just um kind of look at that. I know that's main focus a lot of times. Yeah. Um, go back to the profile, and we'll. I'll, so I, Who do you want to I click this profile and then, um, you know, he's running a health set and a defense set on, on Rex. I Let's think that's just Rex. fine. So Rex is fine. Potentially he, he's got a three dot sitting on his Rex, um, for a circle. He might want to change that to a protection. I'll pull up Rex now. Um, and he might want to change it to a protection one. And Rex is also not normally a big damage dealer. You pretty much want to keep Rex alive. So he might not. You might want to move that crit damage off of Rex and but, run either a run yeah, a protection the triangle, triangle or run yeah, something. Yeah, the triangle's else. a defense one. The, tri the triangle he might want to look at if we look at his um if we look at wedge too. he's running all he's running all health sets with a protection with a protection arrow. I think we want to change that to a to a um to a to a speed arrow and potentially we want to look at running um running crit damage and crit chance sets on wedge. That would probably be uh, be what I would want to be looking at for wedge is running crit damage for the triangle, running a speed arrow, running a protection circle, and then in the cross spot you probably want to stay with that protection. Um, you could potentially run potency for the de defense down, but it probably we need more survivability in uh, in arena. So that's probably where we'd want to go there. Wedge, uh, uh, excuse me, Bigs is the same I'm looking deal. At his wedge, yeah, I mean like that 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 arrow. That arrow, the arrow, the arrow is the big one, that, and the and then yeah, also two on his bigs. Up. I'm looking at his bigs. The on his bigs, he's running a two dot circle. Um, we probably want to change that to a five dot circle just to give him a little bit more. I know why he's running. He's running it because it has six speed in that up, spot. Uh, um, his I, bigs. I still think that you know wedge is your big damage dealer on that team. So yeah. we probably want to look at we probably want to look at a speed um, speed arrow. A crit damage triangle, and then we could. I could. I'm still good with that offense for his uh, cross. If you wanted to, um, you could also run protection on that cross, um, or and then on the circle, we definitely want to run protection over health. Yeah, that uh, circle is. And theoretically, theoretically, we would want to run a crit damage crit set, crit chance set yeah. on him. But if we didn't have the ability to do that, we could also run a speed set on him. There's a bunch of there. There's a bunch of different sets you could run. Potentially, the reason why he's not running this set is because he's going up against a bunch of malls. And if that's the case, he could maybe go away and just run a speed set. That's why I think he I, needs to change his team. I mean, I mean, if this is the team he wants to run, but I mean, he does. When I go back and look at his profile, right? He right? has. Uh, let me go back here. I, I'm just doing this off memory until it, uh, it uploads. Sure. His uh, he has Boba Fett Gear Ten. That's a possibility mm -hmm. he could I, run. Um, I love where I love where his base is at. By the way, he has base perfectly modded. Okay, good. Um, the one the the one chat the one thing I might want to change he has he has all health sets 
speed and then protection around the horn. So protection triangle, protection cross, and protection circle. We are running a three dot um, protection triangle. If we could find a better triangle, we might look at that. And then on his Chirrut, Chirrut is also a big damage dealer. Um, Chirrut is modded pretty much perfectly, all health um, with protection, with a speed arrow and protection around the horn. I'm great with that. Potentially, you might look at running an offense set on Chirrut if you had it. But um, I definitely like how he has this modded speed on almost every mod. Uh, potentially, he might need to do a little bit more mod farming. Yeah, I think he does. Um, that might um, be that might that might be where we're where we're at a little bit. Is we have seven pages of mods. We have four, we have four hundred and sixteen mods on a, on a character. Uh, potentially, we might want to do that. Let's look at um. Well, the thing I was looking at is I would get rid of the wedge look. and bigs. And the reason I'm saying that he has a ten uh, gear gear ten seven star eighty five Bubba he can run, and he, he could, could run Bubba on that. Bubba he also would has be a, a great Kylo character Ren. for an, an ability block. Bubba would be a good Kylo character for is seven for, stars um, and gear nine for a one for a one shot. He could do that. Um, sure. You know, I mean, I see two, why he's running wedge. I mean, I do. I, I kind of like his team. Islands. I do, but it, that team on on defense is just it gets crushed. I crush it all the time. It it just gets crushed. By not only the triple clans, before I went, yeah. Rex Lee, before I went with that, I, I, I might want to change his mods up a little bit. I guess before I, before I w told him that swap yeah, his out mods could be really hurting him too. So yeah, we could I, do I that. I think we could. I think we could easily get him into into probably um, ranging between eleven and twenty instead yeah. of. And yeah, I think we could get him into that eleven to twenty range. Just the mods yeah. range that way. Just changing a few mods. And and that kid that keeps him with some with a team that he's um that he's that he's used to yeah so um that that's kind of right that's kind of where I see that but then um, the other thing I guess we need to look at you know so we've looked at his uh we've looked at his arena team the next thing I think we want to look at is let's figure out a if we have the ability to run a um some some version of a solo team in the uh, in the rancor. Right, and so that would mean he's still working on Vader. Um, he's got a six-star Vader. I think yeah. he continues on with Vader. I agree. I noticed. I noticed here that he's also got a uh, Jen that he's working on, getting yeah. a seven-star. I think Jen is a great piece Absolutely. that will work very. That will work very well for him. She's he did get a five, He did get a five-star Thrawn. Potentially Thrawn is viable at five-star. He all, and, and then he also has a five-star R two D two. Um, yeah, that's and so a great I think those two characters, yeah, you could go with, um, th both of those could work, could work well for him. Um, he's so, got and a five star Kenobi has, too. Yep. And he, and he also has a six star TIE fighter pilot. I think that the six star TIE fighter pilot, um, could also be a good choice for him. Um, yeah. as far as, uh, as, as far as continuing on that, um, on that character. Um, I, and then slowly, I would say very slowly work his Phoenix, for when the next Phoenix event comes up, but oh, I think yeah. he's got them. I, I wouldn't overly worry about Phoenix for a little bit. Maybe just I would stop. Here's a great message for everybody: stop working on Phoenix. Yeah, <laughs> just, it's, I mean, the it's not, over, it'll come. It'll, event, it'll, you'll know ahead of time now when it's coming back. It'll give you plenty of time yep. to finish them off. Um, and you can totally to, yeah. slow roll that one. Yeah. You, so I, mean, um, I think absolutely. We, let's I mean, look at it. So I, I think what's the, the next thing after we talk about Rancor. We have to jump back over to the game because it doesn't show an SWGOH. All right, so let me and that switch is, that. And that, and that, it, and that, the what I would look at here is I would look at what is he running in ships and where is he at in ships. So I've got his ships up right now. He's running an Akbar. I'm trying to uh, Bigs Dark Lighter. There we go. Ship, and then he's all, and then he's running. Um, let's see. He's running a, a tie advanced. Okay. And then he's running uh, Jedi Consular. And then he's running, I think, Boba Fett and Fives. I like his lineup. Um, I like that lineup quite a bit. He's running basically three target lockers, four target lockers, and a healer with a with a taunt. Um, I, I like that. I don't know. We don't know what his setup is on the backside. Yeah, um, I would wonder if I, he has because he does have Tie Fighter Pilot open. What level his Tie Fighter? His what's so his, his first his order Tie Fighter Pilot? I mean, his first, his first order, yeah, his first order Tie Fighter Pilot. Yeah, um, is level seventy five. 
So potentially, um, excuse me, that's Imperial TIE Fighter Pilot. Let me get over here to First Order. Is level 80, Is he's running, he's got a gear 11. Um, he could actually, and that, that one is that maxed. In. I would... I would I would finish off that ship and, and he could put run that in that ship lineup. now. I would put that in over uh, Essentially he could run that no, I'm sorry. It it does funny things whenever I click on it. Huh. Cuz it goes back, it goes back to mine. So oh, I have to look okay. at it in so, this yeah, so yeah, so let's so look at it here. So he's only level 60. Level 60. He needs to probably work on that one a little bit. Yeah. That's probably one of the best ships. Oh, so by he could far. definitely it's put the a, best, one of the best put a little bit in there. Yeah, slave I think one that, is definitely I think that, a good one. Uh, and and first order type probably are two ships you want. Looking to at use. his ships, he could potentially level these. I would level these other three, these other ships. I would level um, the Jedi Consular ship and the five ship up to level eighty four to get all the abilities. And then on the um, on the on the second row here, the characters that he's running as a as a backup, I'd probably want to want to put. Um, First order tie pilot on his on his front line, advanced tie on his front line, um, and then I'd want to put uh, Biggs on his front line, no, and I'd want to put and I'd want to put um, potentially uh, Slave One and put Umbarin on the front line, and then Lee, and then put uh, put Jedi Consular in his um, in in his reinforcements, mm. put first order tie pilot in his reinforcements. And Mall then ship. potentially, He's, he can put that to six stars, and his mall's level eighty. He could, that could, that, he could put, that needs to be one of his reinforcements. He could put Ahsoka Tano. Um, you know, we could we could do a bunch of things that would help him out and get him, uh, maybe from, you know, in ships, you know, getting from rank three sixty five to maybe rank two hundred would probably be what I would look at. We want to be looking at for him. I think too, if he helps his mods on some of these. On oh, some of these, it'll, it'll it'll also help because he's running some kind of lower end mods on some of his characters. If he was able to rework his mods a little bit, that would help. Yeah. So, but one, o- over, yeah, but overall, he's doing really. Yeah. Overall, he's doing really well. Just a little bit of tweaking, and I feel like that he um, kind of some of the things he probably needs to keep working on. Keep farming Chirut. Keep, excuse me. Keep farming bays. Those would be the those would be two of his farms. Yeah. Absolutely. That I would that I would look at. I would probably tell him to go to go pretty hardcore in the mod shop for a little. I mean, in the mod uh, mod challenges for a little bit. The the mod, you know, to get some more mods. Yeah. For the mod bat for uh and and try to work on mod sets Potency, and work in that kind of, crit- critical chance. Up, you know, and those... then work on getting the rest of his arena team up to gear eleven. And and uh, and how you can do that is by uh, keep working your Vader. Mm-hmm. Um. And, and kind of go from there, but he's doing really well. Yeah, I'm pretty excited these about. Are, I'm pretty these excited. Are, these about are just yeah. These are just minor tweaks, you know. Yeah, um, you know, talking about it, talking about his heroic AAT. You know, he's kind of a lot. He's kind of got a lot of teams. Um, I probably would not focus super hard on the on scoring high in the heroic AAT at this point. No, no. I would yet. I would work on arena ships and rancor, and then just work on your farming and the and the heroic AAT just. Play around, have a great time. Make sure you show up to every heroic AAT and do your best. Um, and and maybe you know maybe work on a um, you know run maybe a Jedi team in P one, a droid team in P two. Um, run runs uh, you know run some kind of uh, Palpatine uh, you know Tebow and and Emperor Palpatine team in P three, and then in P four. Um, it looks like he's got most of his clones up, and so he may potentially. Be able to run some version of a clone team, or yeah, just throw I really everything like the else. Clone team in P- phase four. <laughs> with Leia. Or, that that or team's just, dynamite. You know, you know, he's got he's got two clones. He's got five and Rex. He could run some kind of fives Rex team. Uh, not a full. He doesn't have a full clone team. Full clone team takes forever, dude. Yes, we both so, know. We both have them. <laughs> he could run a. You know, he could oh, run a. Uh, he could run a. He could run a rebel team like a wedge Biggs Lando kind of team. In yeah, that's still pretty good. I mean, Akbar Lando with the Biggs Wedge and Leia combo is still pretty yep. decent. You can do really well with that team. He could probably, he could probably run a melt. So potentially, potentially with his with modding it correctly, he could. You know, depending on how they raid and depending on how everything works, he could probably score. You, you know, north of nine hundred thousand to probably sure. a million and a half. It'd be a respectable score, and it um it would you know it work work really well for him. But I feel like he's he's kind of on the right path. Love the guild he's in. Love the fact that he's a supporter. Um, and he can just work on a work on a few a few little minor tweaks, and 
he'll be enjoying life a whole bunch. I, I think so too. So is there anything else we need to cover? I mean, uh, I think we've pretty much done the I big think we parts. have. I know, yeah, ships, I know we're, I know we're going to try to do, we're going to try to do some more roster reviews. Um, so if anybody here would like to get a roster review by Ranger and myself, um, hit us up in discord, hit us up here on this YouTube channel and we'll make sure that we get you in the queue for doing a roster. Absolutely. Review. We big, actually have a big, queue set up for this. <laughs> big shout out to Vormax. We appreciate how big of a supporter he is of us. And we definitely appreciate how, how much he uh, comes on the, comes on the show and, and uh and and talks in chat and comes into our voice chats and yeah and is with us on wednesdays and saturdays so thanks absolutely. a bunch more max and yep. we're more than happy to do this for you absolutely and if you like what you see here please give us a thumbs up subscribe to the channel so you can get the uh latest updates on these ross reviews and other the, all the other great content that we're putting out and we have a donate button we've got a we've got a mm -hmm. we've got our own shop for merchandise so if you want a t-shirt or anything from all the craziness we've said in the past uh i mean We've got quite a few slogans now, uh, but you can follow us on Twitter. You can follow us on Facebook. We've got all kinds of stuff happening. So uh, I think we can call this one done. So it's in the can, buddy. Yeah, we can put this. We can lock this in as completed. Good, grande. Good. Uh, so I'm See you guys on the next one. Yes. So I'm happy myself and grande. Thanks, guys, for joining us. And we will catch you on the next show or the next review. Take care.